Angie Edge from the Wisconsin Milk Marketing Board is here, and this month we're cooking with a little spices for the New we Year. Happy New Year, Happy by New the way. Happy New Year to you. We're heating up the New Year with some bigger, bolder flavors, and we're really seeing a trend for chili-infused cheeses, things that give you a little kick, a little spice for the New Year. Um, some of those cheeses have really shown growth this last year. Habanero cheeses, some of the ones we have here today, are up 73% in sales. We have a uh, um, chipotle smoked gouda here. Chipotle flavored hmm. um, goudas are actually up 173%. So people are liking big, bold flavors. Well, especially when it's cold. Oh, it's yeah. Cool. Heat you up, warm you up a little mouth? bit. Absolutely. So we have a semi-homemade pizza that has pepper jack and chicken. Uh, very easy to make. You basically start with a pre-made thin crust. You want to use a thin crust so you can save it for all those wonderful flavors you're going to use for the cheeses. And basically just spread on some pre-made sauce. So easy enough, you can do that. Um, buy those flavors. And then we actually have a mix of three different Wisconsin cheeses that we're using. The first we're going to use, maybe I'll have you put some on here, okay. is a Wisconsin Fontina cheese. It's an Italian style cheese. Probably one of the most versatile and popular cheeses because it's wonderful for a table cheese, but also melts wonderful and is great for cooking as well. What's so it called again? Fontina. Fontina. So some new uh, flavors to try in the new year. Mm. We haven't found a cheese you haven't liked no, yet. So <laughs> This is a um, pepper jack cheese with some habanero flavoring. Um, Monterey Jack is a great cheese to use for, for pepper jack and flavoring. Add a little more spice and kick to it. Uh, very popular cheese here in Wisconsin. And then this one's probably my favorite. It's the um, smoked um, Chipotle Jack Gouda. That's so this, this, that's this, guy this here. one right there, yep. So that also adds a lot of nice flavor. So it's kind of fun to use new and different kinds of cheeses for pizza that's going to give it a lot of nice flavor and variety instead of the, you know, the traditional mozzarella every single time. Right. So those three cheeses are going to add a lot All of right. nice spice. Then we have some um, grilled chicken we're going to add as well. Um, basically, anyone can make this pizza because you just layer things <laughs> on. <laughs> and then um, some roasted red bell peppers. And not only adds a lot of nice flavor, but some great coloring mm -hmm. to to the pizza as well and you get some uh, vegetables and then we have some mushrooms that we're going to layer on as well so you're getting your vegetables and then lastly you can either use cilantro or parsley to give it a little bit of extra color a little bit extra flavor you can see it, it melts really nicely we cooked it at 450 degrees in the oven for about um, 11 to 12 minutes not much at all and you can throw <laughs> some sausage on yours if you want to yeah th those are some of the things that pair nicely with um, some of the cheeses that we have the smoked sausages are very popular this year as well so the big growing tr growing trend is Bold, bold flavors. infused cheeses. Yes, yes. <laughs> All right, you can find the recipe online at eatwisconsincheese.com. It smells great. It looks great. Yeah. Happy New Year Happy again. Happy New Year. We'll see you next month. We'll be right back with a final check of your forecast.